here and welcome to another Lawn Fawn video. Today we are so excited to be introducing our Nit Picky Winter Paper Collection. This collection is so sweet. We have it in both a 12 by 12 size and a 6 by 6 size. So let's go ahead and check it out. Our 12 by 12 sizes come in two ways. They come in this style, which is a collection pack, which has two of each of the papers for a total of 12 papers, or you can also get the papers in individual. So for example, you could get all of the red paper, so 12 of just the red, 12 of just the blue, and this is really great if you're working on something like uh, invitations where you need a lot of one color. So let's go ahead and check out all of these gorgeous papers. First up, we have our warm beanie paper, which is this beautiful red with a great print on the front and then this knit paper on the back. This is Lost Mitten, which is a super cute pink for the holidays, but will be really cute for Valentine's Day too. And on the back, it has this really great multicolor knit as well. Next up, we have our green paper and it's called Itchy Sweater, which always makes me laugh. It has this really, really great sweater print on the front. And then of course, on the back, we also have the multicolor knit. And I love these multicolor knits because it's almost like a solid color cardstock, but with a little extra something. Next up, we have our turquoise paper, which is Cozy Scarf. Once again, beautiful print on the front. And then we get that multicolor knit on the back. Then next up, we have this gorgeous bright blue that just makes me smile, and this is called Favorite Socks. I also just love socks too. So we have this great print, and then of course the multicolor knit on the back of this paper. And then last but not least, we have Baby Blanket, which is this really great beige. And I love it for both winter and also fall. It's just beautiful. Once again, it has the multicolor knit on the back. And this one, I just love using in backgrounds. It's just so pretty. And then of course, because in the collection kit, we have two of each paper, all of these papers repeat. Or of course, you can also get just one paper, 12 of each of them, just one color in a pack as well. And then here's a comparison between all of the different papers, both the A sides and the B sides. I love these colors. I love that you can get the traditional red and green together, or you can do something kind of different like the pink and the turquoise. That blue is so much fun too, and I love the beige as this great neutral background. Now here is the 6x6 pad, and the 6x6 pad has 36 sheets, which means you get three of each of the papers. And then the 6x6 pad, the designs are reduced down for a smaller size. So it kind of just depends on my project if I want to use the 12x12 or if I want to use the 6x6. And you can see these little mini prints are so cute, and you have them in the same gorgeous colors. You have the red and the pink, the green, the turquoise, the blue, and the beige. And they're just so pretty, and I love seeing the multicolor color knits in that beautiful smaller print. And so here's that great blue, and then we're gonna finish up with the beige. And then you'll see that these papers are gonna repeat. And I love that because it means you don't have to hoard the papers because you do get three of each. So then all of these papers will repeat two more times for a total of 36 sheets, three of each of the 12 designs. And then here, I wanted to show you a comparison between the 6x6 and the 12x12, because it's always really nice to see the two next to each other. And so there you can see that the design is reduced about 50%, um, and it looks absolutely beautiful in both ways. It really just depends on the project that you're working on. And then here for the B sides, here's a nice comparison. So you can see both the 6x6 scale and the 12x12 scale. And then now I wanted to show you some incredible cards and also layouts by the design team. And this first card here by Elise, oh my goodness, she used the stitched poinsettia die and she die cut the awesome knit papers with it and I just love how it looks. These little hot cocoa and candy cane holders by Tammy could not be sweeter. I love that she die cut the different pieces for the snowmen from the knit picky paper. It makes them look like actual knit scarves. Here, this card by Audrey is so much fun. She used the giant Oh What Fun die, and she has that beautiful knit in the background, and I just love it. Here, Elena shows us how that awesome beige knit paper is the perfect background for cute scenes like this. These little pillow boxes by Marine are so sweet, you could fill them with gift cards or with little treats, and I love the ugly and bright critters on top. And then this layout by Melissa Stinson. Oh my goodness, is this not so sweet? What a fun way to show off cute holiday sweaters or fun holiday pajamas. Lynette shows us how Ugly and Bright is a perfect match to these nitpicky winter papers. They look so cute together. And then Melissa Mann created a gorgeous layout. I love how she has the strips of paper that she stitched over all lined up together. It's so pretty to see all of the colors together and this is such a gorgeous layout. 
I love that Grace used the paper for not only the background of her card, but also to die cut that adorable stitched teacup. This shadow box card is so sweet and so gorgeous, and I love the hot foiled snowflakes in the background too. Here in this card by Megan, she shows us that this blue paper is perfect for wintry cards. It's so gorgeous and so fun. And then this card by Mindy is so sweet. I love that she used the background paper and then also die cut the trees and beautiful garland from the Knit Picky paper as well. This layout by Melissa is so beautiful. I love that she used this as a way to share a family recipe too. Such a cute way to do it. And I just love those distress edges on the paper. And then here, Leticia used a really cute gift with purchase this year to use these cute little banners with a nitpicky paper that just makes me smile. So we cannot wait to see what you guys create with nitpicky winter. So make sure to share it with us. Thank you so much for watching today. And I hope you have an absolutely amazing day. Bye. Thank you.